So today I'm back with a mermaid inspired look. So this is my green hair which um, was promised to, to you quite a while back. It's actually a bit faded already as you can see it's like like all the blonde is coming up. But basically it's still quite intense and but the blue has faded to a purple already so anyway so I hope you like this video please enjoy so let's start with foundation so I'm using my Bobbi Brown uh, skin foundation it's in warm sand 2.5 just apply it Next, I'm using my Bobbi Brown Concealer. It's in beige. So there's a creamy side and the powder side. So I just use the creamy side to conceal my dark eye, eye rings. Yep. I find this is like the best concealer for uh, dark eye rings. I've tried a lot. So yeah, this has the most coverage. And I like it. Doesn't look too cakey as well. I just use my finger to like blend it out. And any other places where you want to conceal. Next I'll be using my Urban Decay D Slick Powder to just set in the makeup, the foundation and the concealer. Just dust just dust, you know. Okay, next moving on to brows, I'll just be using my brown eye pencil to fill it in. And just take an angle brush to just um, blend it up. For the brows. Next, I'll be using my Urban Decay Primer Potion on my lids. Okay, so today we're going for a more like mermaidy, like um, like colorful look. So. We'll be using my Sugar Peel uh, Sweetheart Palette. So I'll be starting with the um, Midori, the green colour. So just taking a very, just a flat brush. Just like load up the awesome colours. And just pack it onto your eyelids. As you can see, it's like super intense. But once we like blend it out, it'll be a bit better. Okay. So just taking a fluffy brushes, lightly blend out the edges. You don't want to blend too much because you'll lose like the colors. Next, taking a pencil brush, I'll be using the color After Party, the blue, very intense blue. And I'll just be uh, going over my crease line. You can bring it down the side of your eye as well. I know it looks like crazy intense now, but we blend it out. Okay. Okay, next we'll be taking uh, blackout or any black matte black colour. Just like using the same pencil brush, I'll just take a little bit of product to just intensify the, the corner of the eyes.
if you want a more smoky eye then you can actually add more black but I'll just put a little bit just to show you guys then blend it out to highlight my brow bones I'll be using um, Virgin from the Naked Palette Take a small brush and just highlight the brow bone. Just blend a little bit more. Okay, I've got something really exciting. So, like, just to jazz it up, I've got my Sugar Pill Goldilocks um, pigment. So I'll just be like taking just a little bit from the cover. Wait. Just be taking a little bit from the cover with my small brush. I'm just like putting it a little bit in, in the corner of the eyes. Just for the pop of like bedazzlement. <laughs> I kind of really like this. Next, I'll be taking my Urban Decay 24-7 pencil in perversion. It's the really like intense black kind of thing. So I don't want to draw on my on top of my eyelid, so I'll just like tight line it. It's like really dark, so you gotta be really careful. I don't want to look like I got punched in the eye. <laughs> this waterline. Okay, just a little bit. <laughs> we'll do. Next, we'll curl our lashes. So this is the Maybelline Hypercurl Volume Express Waterproof Cat Eye Mascara. <sighs> it's always a mouthful to say this name. So yeah. Not forgetting lower lashes. Okay, for blush I have my um, the BH Cosmetic Blush Palette. So I'll be taking slightly more corally pinky, it's like maybe these two kind of colours. Just apply it generously. Because like with my coloured hair now, like I tend to look really washed out if I don't really put a lot of makeup. So like color my face. Lastly, uh, lips. I have um, two choices that I can make. I recently got like a lot of NYX products. So uh, this is the NYX uh, Soft Matte Lip Cream in Addis Ababa. Addis Ababa. And this is uh, in uh, Eucalyptus. This is the Lip Smacking Fun Colors. So this is more for a matte look and this is more like for just a normal lipstick. So I'll just show you the normal lipstick. They're basically very similar colours so you can choose either one. As you can see it's really intense pink. We really like this colour. Okay. the final look this is my mermaid kind of look that to match my hair so I hope you like the video thank you for watching my video I hope you like this look so please like comment and subscribe and I'll see you soon bye